Hello guys, Georgia is here, back again with me. In this video, I will show you how to make a simple and minimalist lamp model. I will recreate and changing a little the design of one of the furniture brand from the Czech Republic called Torus. And the lamp model is auto slide. And in this video, we will create or recreate a lamp model from Torus. Before going to the video tutorial, if you want a file model like this, you can join to be my patron, link down below. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you like some content like this. Alright, so guys, now first thing first that I'm gonna do over here, I will delete all of this. Click X and then add some cylinder. Alright, and then over here, let's changing into a 45. Set auto smooth. And then after that, just click tab using faces. Choose it the uh, up there and the uh, bottom. Click I, just make it a little bit smaller. There's something like that, but we can see it from here. S and then Z just make it a little bit more smaller at least something like this so if you are already uh, satisfied with this size just click x and then faces click tab again and then just make it a little bit short at least something like this so after this let's go move into the modifier and then after that let's go add some a subdivision surface changing this viewport into three and also this render into three so just set auto smooth and then after that we can make it more a little bit more wider so if you already do that just a click apply and then add some solidify and over here just add it more into like point uh 02 and just uh, apply this one so after this add some bevel and in this bevel just at least uh 20 and for a month just like 0.01 and will be looks like this smooth all right so now just grab it this one going up a little bit at least something like this sip a and then i will add some cylinder set auto smooth make it a little bit uh thickness at least something like this so we can see it from here click tab click i add some a little bit detail over here grab it down a little bit and then click i click e click I again then grab it up and now we can see from here so over here we'll be using for a bulb or light and then after this let's go move into the add modifier we will add some a bevel same as like before here just 20 and mine just like using 0 0.01 so it will be looks like this don't forget to save your file and now let's go move into the a other side which is we will a using some a metal from here into the up there and now let's go add some curve sip a and then curve and after that using a uh, this pad now ry90 after that just go into the modifier generate you can find some mirror we will using this click tab move it into the uh, right side all right so this one is wrong so will be z and now let's grab it up over here or maybe just keep it like this here you can grab it up here and then now let's uh, activate this clipping but we have to go down first I forget to a uh, add some depth all right so if you already do that let's go a uh, using this one click tab just only this one and then click E G and then X to the left and then now go down just move it this one exactly here and now this uh all right so just move it over here at least something like this and then now we can try to move it or do a little bit a uh, editing for this uh vertex so just grab it up a little bit and this yep this is kind of cool but i think this is kind of looks so small so we have to edit more and um, yeah at least something like this this is kind of better and looks cool so yeah let's uh, bring up this resolution into a 32 so will be more look smooth than before all right so now uh, I will using some blender kit I uh, will add some bulb all right so I will using this one so just click here Make it more bigger and bring back this all right so guys now let's go move into this uh side editor and we will do a little bit changing over here and for this one i will using a blender kit and then i will using some canvas 
canvas so just changing we can try to find it the uh, canvas that we want to use it which is this one so just click and then wait a few seconds while downloading and it will be looks like this so this is i didn't scale it up yet so it will be just looks like that and Control a and scale so we can bring back here over here and then we can click again so it will be looks like that and then now let's go move into the uv editing let's add it a little bit here click a and then just map uv object and then now we can see from here how it looks like which is good or not and um, yeah we can uh, grab it up more so it will be looks like this this is kind of cool and more than before now let's go back into the layout let's choosing this one but i think this one it's kind of too big let's try to decrease a little bit into a 0.05 so it looks like this let's add some a material for this object a color ramp put down here and then noise texture fact into the fact and then color into the base color so i will duplicate this one cd all right just do the same as like before and connect it to the roughness all right so this is kind of looks better but let's changing the color from a dark side into the um to more dark like this so now this is looks kind of better and we can play also about here for the roughness it looks like uh will be looks like that and now over here i want to add the same color as this one and now it will be looks like that this is kind of looks cool and here for the um canvas i'm gonna try to bring down a little bit for the alpha so we can see about the light how it looks like so this is kind of uh, yeah this is still dark because we are using some ev we can move it into the cycles and then we can see from here all right and then yep yeah, we can a uh, connect this one into the um into the emission just connect this over here so it will be looks like this and bright all right so guys now we can try to bring down a little bit so we can have it the exact color that we want to see over here all right so now it will be looks like this and now let's go add some uh, empty we will uh, using this cube i think will be better so just grab it up make sure they're having a little bit same size as this one all right that's cool so after that just choosing all of that Control v and then keep transform all right so guys now tutorial for today it's done and if you want to have file exactly like this you can join to be my patreon link down below and don't forget to like comment and subscribe georgia is here see you in the next video ciao ciao